Hello, my name is Kimura. Thank you very much for giving me a chance to present you about useful social welfare equipment for mobilization at this International Federation for Dementia Care. Let me start from my self-introduction. I was brought up in Malaysia and Singapore, 1980s, and graduated from Nihon Fukushi University, which is number one social worker human development in Japan. I also learned multicultural understanding at Hanoi University, 1994, and participatory approach to community development in the University of the Philippines, 1995 and 1996. I have been working as social worker, care worker, and social welfare equipment advisor for 25 years, including human development. In private, I have been working as lecturer for Japanese and foreign care workers and also social workers. So what is social welfare equipment? According to the law, act on the promotion of research, development, and dissemination of social welfare equipment, which is to improve activities of daily living and to rehabilitate elderly who has disability of daily life by deterioration of mental and physical function. There are two purposes of social welfare equipment. First one is supporting independence. Second one is reduce care burden of family and care worker. And what is care robot? Care robot is care equipment, applied robot technology which is useful for supporting independence and reduce care burden. One of the social welfare equipment. <clears throat> Japanese government is supporting priority areas as transfer, moving, excretion, monitoring, communication, bathing, and care service. I want to share about consciousness investigation in Japan. The question is, do you want to receive physical care by robot if it is necessary? Answered by 1,238 people over 40 years in 2018. 13.1% <clears throat> answered Yes, positively. 71.2% answered yes, if recommended. So totally 84.3% answered they want to receive physical care by robot. They are care robot demonstration effectiveness investigation Paper survey answered 1,845 facility, facilities 2016. Visiting survey answered 28 facilities 2017. Users evaluation. There is no consideration. There is no hesitation to staffs effective to prevent from physical and mental decline, reduce falling down, reduce incontinence, safe than human care, and relief. Staff's evaluation, physical and mental care burden, get breathing room, understand activities pattern, Take time for communication with users. Very positive. 
as you know, Japanese care style is focusing on respect human dignity, supporting independence, and arranging care environment, social welfare equipment, and care robot is effective. Effective and concrete methods. We have home renovation and social welfare equipment, including care robot. Home renovation. We have construction of handrails, step elimination, etc. An important point is plus rehabilitation, plus participation is effective. I also want to share system of social welfare equipment in Japan. At home, they are rental and purchase financial supporting system. Under the long-term care system, users can choose appropriate equipment from various items after consulting with care manager, rehabilitation staff, and social welfare equipment advisor. They just pay only 10 to 30% of rental or purchase fee. A nursing facility. Facility has to prepare equipment from their operational budget. Care manager, care worker, and rehabilitation staff choose equipment for users. So if the policy of facility attach great importance to equipment effectiveness, they prepare various items, but if not, limited items. There is dental or review systems for facilities which cannot prepare enough budget to purchase. Team care is very important in Japan. If you used to say, I want to be able to walk by myself again, family member want to support, doctor and nurse give medical advice, physical, occupational therapist give rehabilitation advice, social welfare equipment advisor introduce various items, Care worker, give care and report. And care manager has a responsibility of total management. And we have lots of confidence for each person, each aged. The point of management of balance and force. Select and use equipment appropriate for each age and each scene. Ensuring safety from getting up on the bed to the place age want to go, so that their activities of daily living and quality of life improve. Prepare a chance to step up the way to transfer and move at rehabilitation so that they can continue to use equipment safety and keep motivation. Prepare a chance to learn and use equipment safety for family, care workers, and care manager so that they can provide care with constant quality. So from here, I want to introduce many equipment in each scene. As you know, our life starts from getting up on the bed. So it should be safety. It should be used minimum power to keep energy for safety transfer and move.
I want to introduce you useful function for special care bed. We usually have two motor spit and three motor spit, which function is <clears throat> as you just heat to prevent from that pain of care workers or families. As you just backlighting to get up easily and as you just backlighting and utilizing separately. And now we have four motor spit in Japan, which function is to adjust the angle of head to prevent from swallowing. Bed breathing is usually see only seeing, but if they could look straight and talk with someone, it stimulates brain to prevent from dementia. Handrail is used for supporting independence, for getting up and standing up. The way of safety transfer. It's dangerous to transfer age if he or she is bigger than care worker or family. New policy in Japan say we care workers can carry only his or her weight should be under 40% of ours. If care workers are female, their weight should be under 24% of ours. This means if my weight is 55 kilogram, I can transfer age or challenged whose weight is under 22 kilogram. If I am female, I can do for those whose weight is under 13.2 kilogram. In other words, if their weight is 60 kilogram, our weight should be more than 100 kilogram in male. 250 kilogram in female. It's impossible. So we should use social welfare equipment for safety and comfortable care. After new guidelines for back pain prevention by Ministry of Health, Labor and Welfare in 2013 was announced, we made importance of using social welfare equipment and Kellobot. There are many chances to learn how to choose and use for professionals, and sometimes for families. Sliding board is useful for aged who cannot stand up or sit down well but they can keep sitting posture, including holding handrails. Nursing lift is useful for aged who cannot sit in posture well. So this is very important. We should need to prepare, what we should need to prepare is special bed, which has height adjustment so that aged can slide from higher place to lower place. Wheelchair, which leg support and arm support can take off or move so that we can approach wheelchair close to the bed as much as possible. How to use is, aged can transfer by themselves if they can push and pull by themselves, like my picture. We can support, just push their body with minimum power if they cannot by themselves. If they have heavy weight, we can support them with two care workers from front and back. Let's think about the case 
we should use flooding board. The case is from Learn Through Manga, titled The Safety and Health of Nursing Care Industry, published by Ministry of Health, Labor, and Welfare. So please watch the video. Case two. Oh, my back still hurts. Thank you for waiting. I must be heavy. Sorry. I would eat a lot since I was young. So I'm big. No problem. Leave it to me. Okay. Let's move you to the bed. Hey, come here. It's a rule to assist the big person with two people. You fell down recently, so don't do overdo yourself. This is a rule that protects your body and those of the elderly. I may not look like it, but I work out. Check out my power of you. Definitely a no. I'll bring eggs so wait here. No? I don't want to inconvenience my senior, so I'll do this myself. Hmm, he's heavier than I thought. You all right? I don't think I can do this on my own. Then I'll just have to force it. Ah. Uh... Could it be you have a bad back? You have to use assistive devices when you're assisting on your own. For example, with this slide board. Put one side on top of the bed and slide other side under their button. And there. That's how easy you can do it. Are you okay? Pull yourself together. Hmm. Acute lower back pain. In other words, you throw out your back. From now on, practice postures that reduce strain on the back. When assisting well built people, Use protective gear and assistive devices as much as possible. And you have to report without hesitation when you're not feeling well. We are wanting. Finally, always follow the rules. I learned the importance of following the rules of the facility the hard way. This video was made by these members. So what do you think? Unfortunately, we still have these cases. Case two. Okay. There are many types of nursing lift. Types to fix bed. Types to approach when it's necessary to use. Types to build up tower. These can transfer from bed to decided place. These can transfer from bed to any place in the room. These can transfer to any place in the house or facility where they are laid or on the ceiling. Types of special using in baby. Types of special use in getting car in or out. I want to introduce you another video. User's voice. The title is Daily Life with a Nursing Lift. ハイゴリフトのある暮らし。山形県鶴岡市に住む竹久昭夫さんは、44歳の時、脳幹出血を発症。長い入院生活の後、自宅に帰ります。四島日になり、自分の力では動くことができない絶望的な状況の中で、車
介護リフトの存在を知りましたそこから希望を見つけ出しましたこのビデオでは介護リフトと竹久夫妻の日々を紹介します竹久昭夫さんの家です奥さんと二人暮らし日本海の波音を聞きながらの毎日です元気な頃の竹久さんはエネルギッシュな九十キロの巨体無類の釣り好きでした突然の出来事は11年前のことでした脳幹出血脳出血の中でも特に危険度が高いと言われています釣りに出かけた旅先での発症でした素早い救急車の出動病院での適切な処置のおかげで奇跡的に一命を取り留めましたそれから11年食事も移動も全てに介護が必要な生活が始まりました元気が回復して車での外出が増えるにつれなんとか助手席に乗りたいと思うようになりました助手席から見る風景と車椅子からの風景では感じが全く違うというのです高くてね、景色が見えないんだってそうですよね、はい、どちらどちらの車椅子からだったの神さんは神さんで、はい<笑>俺がどうなるって言ってが心配で、えー、後ろに運転のマブライスですよね。車椅子だとどうしても振動があるので、えーえー、ちょっとしたことでもこう揺れてるのがわかるので、はいえーえー、なんか気が気でなくて、そうですよね。うん、カーブとかもね。そうそうだからカーブの話しかけると、えーえー、黙ってて黙ってて今信号だから黙ってな、そんな状態。いやく車椅子が助手席にセットできるのないのかなって。<笑>うん、はい。助手席にセットできたらいいのになと思って、はい、車、椅子、助手席、携、う、帯、ん、なんかこう、あ、うん、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、<笑>インターネットで介護リフトを知った竹久さん熱心に奥さんを説得します営業担当者にも自分からメールで問い合わせ導入を決断しました奥さんが操作を覚えるのは簡単ではありませんでしたがビデオを繰り返し見て一人で操作できるようになりましたリフトの導入で生活が大きく変わりましたドライブの楽しみが戻り出かける場所も増えました自分たちだけで移動ができるそれが大きな自信にもなりました小柄な奥さんですがリモコン一つで90キロの巨体も持ち上げることができます道具の力が二人の生活に革命をもたらしました奥さんの操作も今はすっかりスムーズになりました介護リフトという道具を知ることによって夢が実現できたのです何気ない会話ができるのも助手席だからこそです今日は風が強いねねえまだまだ3月なのでそうだよね2人の会話も明るくなりましたバンドが来て<笑>あんたねあんたを愛してるなどが分かんないよ<笑>でもね動けない旦那を捨てていくほど私は悪女ではないからそれが安心しなさいって言ったらもう肌切れたかおいしいなんだよこの捨てていく<笑>またおしっこ漏らしてんだ<笑>俺のせいじゃねえよでね<笑> 3月初め
名古屋での農村商社ケアリングコミュニティ学会の打ち合わせに出席するため発病以来初めての空の旅に挑戦しました名古屋の中部国際空港までおよそ1時間のフライトです航空会社による空港でのサポートは考えていた以上に充実していました誰よりも早く席に座り出発を待ちました前の晩は眠れないほど心配したそうですが実際には不自由はありませんでした空港まで自力で行けばサポートが受けられるこの経験は大きな自信になりました介護リフトとの出会いで大きく変わった2人の生活次の夢は中国シルクロードのトンコウの旅だそうです So what do you think about the video? Did you enjoy this? So from here, I want to introduce you many types of mobilization equipment. Each can have advice from care manager, physical therapist, occupational therapist, and social welfare equipment advisor. They can ex experience before they start later. They can be habilitated at home and facility with professionals. And there are many types of walking stick. This is training program to experience left hand hemiplegia. And I use normal stick. Stick with four legs is more stable. New stick has the place to sit to take a rest. And also, it's not heavy. Silver car is popular in Japan, which is well balanced that they can hold with two hands. And also, they can carry purchased item in the box and take a rest when they need. Walker for going outside, which is well balanced than silver car. Because of structure, there are space and age can be close to the walker so that they can straighten their back up and can see front well with better standing posture. This is new electric water walker, one of the care robots. When aged want to go outside, there is a hill. And at uphill, this walker give minimum power to push walker. At downhill, it automatically slow down. There are many types of wheelchair. This can control to move with minimum power. Standing position is important for muscle strengthening exercise, blood circulation, and enjoying sight. This is moved by foot pedal. These types of wheelchair motivate aged to rehabilitate and move by themselves. Six wheeler type is popular in Japan. 
and made in Japan. These can turn in various smaller so that it is very useful at small room in Japan. Usually, the wheelchair turn like this, but six wheeler type turn like this, smaller than that. Nothing left for walking rehabilitation. Support standing up and reduce body weight for the reduction. Reduce body weight towards the reduction and the ability to work on the walking machine. This is also one of the care robot. Yori Sori robot. <coughs> you can watch the video. <coughs> I experienced that exhibition. When I fall, it is very safety. Can you see? Unfortunately, we can we cannot see this often at facilities, but there is a day service which was which was used. And you can see the website, English version, if you want to know more. So from here, I want to introduce you useful equipment for dementia care. Monitoring sensor. Care workers can find and come soon after aged move from bed by sensor alarm to prevent from wandering or going out. It's aged. Stand up from the bed. Sensor mat announced from wireless to receiving machine. Oh, another man. Go out from the room and sensor mat announced from wireless, through wireless, to receiving machine, so that care workers can find out soon. Wheelchair with automatic brake. Put on the brake automatically when aid stand up from wheelchair to prevent from falling down. This is also a new one and you can see video from this website. The important point when aged with main player use equipment. We should pay attention to age, not to use wrong, to prevent from accident, especially electric equipment, which can use by remote controller. Care workers can lock switch so that age cannot use or use wrong. We basically want age to experience to use equipment. We basically want age to experience to use equipment before they get dementia. We won't give them chance for independence life by using equipment to keep motivation. We have big exhibition every year in Japan. I hope you can register and enjoy it online. Thank you very much. Marami Saramapo and Teremakasi.